hello and welcome back to our 30 day challenge. We are now on day 13 of the challenge. If you are new here, my name is Charlotte and I am an English teacher helping you to learn 30 idioms in 30 days so that you feel confident using them in English. If you haven't already watched the previous videos, head down to my description box where I have linked the other videos from the previous day. If not, you're more than welcome just to watch this video. I hope you find it useful. If you haven't already, please like this video and subscribe to make sure that you don't miss out on future videos. So let's get into today's idiom. Today's idiom is on the line. Any idea what it could mean? It doesn't actually mean to stand on a line or to hang on a line. No, 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 no. Instead, it has a more figurative meaning and we're going to see if you can work this out in an example sentence. If I don't finish this project by the deadline, my career is on the line. What do you think it could mean? If someone or something is on the line, it means that that person or thing is at serious risk or harm. So, in that example sentence, it is meaning that if I don't finish the project on time, my career is in serious danger. I might lose my job. Let's look at some other examples. Jack has put his reputation on the line to back this company. He hopes the company won't let him down. This means that Jack's reputation is at risk. If something goes wrong with the company, Jack's reputation is going to be damaged. Or, the police often put their life on the line. Meaning, the police often risk getting hurt in order to protect the public. Okay, your turn. Can you write one sentence with on the line in the comments below? I look forward to reading them. And as always, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and come back tomorrow for day 14 of our 30 day idiom challenge. Have a lovely day and bye for now.